you get given this, right? And you're asked to show that all of the coefficients add up to that, okay? Which is fine. 95% of you guys attempted this the way you would expect it, which is 2x plus y to the 5 is a binomial. It's an expansion. I'm good at expanding binomials, so you just expanded it, you had a look at the numbers, and sure enough, they add up to 243. Minor note, it's a little embarrassing when you come up with numbers that don't add up to 243. And you're like, oh, but it, they're supposed to add up to 243. So you just fudge it. Don't do that. We're looking for the way that you've got the numbers there. There is actually a much easier way, a completely alternative way to do this. And the further we go into the extension one course, the more that this will occur. So I'll look at your solution in a minute because it might be totally fine. If what you're after is the coefficients, okay? For example, have a think about this guy. The very first term will be this. Right? Do you agree? I mean, I, you, I could write it as this, but that's fine. Okay. So, in other words, what's the number you want out of this? The, the 32 is the important part. Okay. But a really quick way to get to that is to notice that one way of saying what are the coefficients equal to is, what is it equal to, what is the whole thing equal to if I don't worry about the x's and the y's? Right? Now, when I say don't worry about the x's and the y's, just make them trivial. Okay. There's a value for x and y that you can choose that makes them contribute nothing to the coefficients, right? If x were 1, if x were 1, you will just get out the 32, right? That's the part that you want, okay? Uh, in the same way, if you make y equal 1, the last term is going to be y to the 5, right? Well, the value that you're after in this case is 1. So again, if you make y equal 1, then you will get out just the one that you're after. Does that make sense? So in fact, a nice completely unrelated, semi-unrelated way of doing this is just say x and y, let them be one. What happens to this thing? Three times five. Which is 243, okay? That's a sweet way to get two marks. 